Good morning, my strictly lovely people. What's going on? What's up? What's popping, babies? So I am back with another read. Okay, early in the morning, currently 9.32 a.m. So I want to jump into the unknowable life, get some characters, see who's up in that energy. If this character, if this particular character resonate within who's in your energy baby let's talk about it let's talk about how they are feeling within this current moment at 9 33 what someone feel like one two three four five six seven eight eight of cups we have the eight of cups right here I feel like someone is walking away, baby. They are walking away. Let's see. Eight of Cups. Because this is going to be a little short read. It's going to be a short, short read. So. It won't be long. So, this, this, this means someone is walking away because they are disappointed. They feel like they've been abandoned. Okay, they also feel like withdrawals is going on. They say in the Eight of Cups, a man walk away from the Eight of Cups standing in the foreground. The cups are arranged in such a way that it looks like one is missing. A sign that emotional fulfillment, something is missing. That's why you're walking away disappointed. Okay, they emotional fulfillment in wholeness, whole, whole, wholeness is lacking. The man has turned his back on these cups with a sense of loss and disappointment and shuffles away into the mountains. A nearby river symbolizes his emotions. You guys can see the river. It symbolizes emotions. Y'all can see that? Um, and the mountain represents the awareness that this would not be an easy journey. It won't be an easy journey. Though it will be necessary for true long-term happiness. Okay, that's the journey true long term happiness the moon in the night sky illuminates the path ahead the man is leaving in the dead of night oh my 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 and hoping to go unnoticed oh suggesting suggesting that there are that that there may be a level of escape or avoidance in this card let's clarify that real quick we got the world card uh will of fortune i guess it's time to walk away i guess it is now time to walk away if you feel like your emotional needs ain't being fulfilled it's time to walk away it's time to say hey be aware be aware that this journey is not going to be easy, but find some hope like you walking away for a reason because at the end of the day, it, it, it would be necessary for true long-term happiness. And you can't get it just by being in a place or destiny that is not serving your good. It's point blank. Point motherfucking blank, period. I hate that, but how I'm feeling at 9.30 this morning, it was just dead. It was just dead. Why they won't let me search up no more cards? It was just dead, collector. Um, uh, let me see. We four minutes in. This good timing. So the Wheel of Fortune is generally an indicator of luck or destiny. You walked away, you finna go into them mountains, okay? And 
it's an indicator of luck or destiny. You're going to find your long-term happiness regardless of the situation, regardless of if you got to go through this journey alone being unfulfilled you know what i'm saying and it's okay that's why you he also said look he trying to be unnoticed nobody ain't dealing with nobody nobody don't need to say nothing to you yes you just need to move okay you just need to walk into that mountain with carry let the river flow your emotions they would have leading you to go there then if the moon is um illuminating your path they're where you should be because at the end of the day it's 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 indicator of luck to your destiny it's a major arcana this signif um signifier of change when the will of fortune appears upright in your tarot reading big changes are coming these changes should be for your greater good but remember not all change it's easy, even if it's leading you to your destiny. And you know what? That is given to you. This this is given to you. Whether this change is easy, whether whether if if it's not. But baby, this is major. This is indicator of luck or destiny. It's given to you. Let's clarify this. Oh. Everything tried to come out. Well, we have the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We have the 10 of Wands, the King of Wands, and the Two of Cups. Let's see something real quick because the 10 of Wands in reverse make me feel like you are able to see your path now. And I feel like within that mountain, the king of one was there waiting for you to come so you guys can have your long-term happiness. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. And sometimes you do have to walk away. Sometimes you just need to get your emotions under control and balance. And that'd be the hardest thing to do all by yourself. You know what I'm saying? Without no help. Without no one to love you. Look, there it go again. The world card. Wishes are being fulfilled. All these options, baby. And guess what? And it's still giving to you what you don't see coming. Mm. In reverse. Yes. So the ten of one reverse is from moving forward to barely holding on. You barely holding on. A complete halting of progress on a particular goal or need that is focal. The hidden and the hurtful guilt is another common source for for the appearance of the ten of wands. Heal. Do I say disappointment because? It, it was a lot of things hidden from you and, and it hurt you probably made you feel guilty be, be aware of lack of balance it said ten of wands cards tends to picture a man or a woman okay overburdened now this king yeah if this cut off on me I'm trying to get through it I don't want to have to do it a thing so the king of wands up in here represent pure fire energy. Oh, wow. It could be a Sagittarius. Pure fire energy in its masculine. Unlike the other ones, the king is not so interested in creation or creativity or in dreaming or uh, up ideas and implement. Oh yeah, excuse my reading. They don't want me to get it out. They this how I feel. They it's hard for them to get it out. And plant and plant implementing them himself in, instead. And he need help with that. He needs someone to pour into him so he you know he ain't into the implementing the creative or dreaming idea for himself. 
but you walked away into something because you were like, look, I can go create this shit on my own. And I feel like you walking right into your destiny. You walking right into...